current circumstances. It may be taking down the middle will say, the this is so fabulous, you know, we got to get on with it. It's uh, important. So, so, in your, so in your view, it's simply not worth exploring uh, in a holistic way uh, the, the entire um, um, uh, gardener and uh, figuring out if there's a way that it could, it, uh, um, an underground rebuild could somehow be in part refinanced uh, by whatever happens in the, in the current space. I, I, th I, think that, I think that certainly it's something that's worth continuing to look at. Consultant fees are cheap compared with big uh, construction errors. Um, so uh, you continue to, to look at it, but uh, it seems to me that the order of business is to not make a mistake on this section, to actually address everything eventually up to York Street. I, there's something on the table now, let's deal with it. We're timid people in Toronto. We want to take down the East Lake first, then we'll take down the Eastern piece, and we'll take. But that. doesn't doesn't whatever we decide to do now basically preclude what we might want to do with the rest of it at some later date? No, it doesn't. No. As well, a matter of fact, only, one only, of the greatest but, things that's happening. Really, only your takedown option, uh, to some degree, doesn't preclude that. Right. Uh, well, that's right. Anything other than than that. Uh, would preclude it's what a, to the it's rest. a terrible <laughs> and it's a terrible mistake one of the things that's happened that's very positive is the Toronto star site um, in all the advanced planning on the Toronto star site Harbor Street is being extended through bisecting the land that is the lead extension which allows us to have Harbor Street one way east Lakeshore one way west a one way pair and that one way pair can take all the turning movements and stacking from the expressway as it delivers people to the center of the city. So that's a tremendous thing. If we had allowed the Toronto Star lands to be obstructed, that'd be a terrible mistake. But we're not, we haven't made the fatal mistake yet. And uh, it seems to me that when we, uh, when we have- But, but, but you're, you're, you're a renowned city builder. And uh, I, in, in that context, I also think you understand the politics of of a of a, uh, of a uh, you know a city asset of this nature, uh, do you really believe that that it's realistic nice for us to just simply say um, you know to take it down? Well, we certainly have had presented to us a digestible incremental improvement, which no, is no, not take it down, but rather eliminate a portion of an expressway. Yes, we can do that. We've seen we've done it. It works fine. Okay. Uh, politics is another question. It's like the Flat Earth Society. People will say, oh, the world's flat. Just look out there. There's the horizon. It's horizontal. Well, I'm glad you understand <laughs> that. Thank you. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm glad you conceded that. Thank you. Uh, thank you very much. And Paul Bedford is next.